Well, what's up, everybody? RS2484 here, and we are back with ATS in our trip to... Uh, right now we're in San Simone. We have started a trip here from uh, San Diego to... I think that's the outskirts of Albuquerque, I think. So, yeah. So, we've got about 444 miles to go, so... Let's go ahead and... What's going on? Oh, a second. Uh, apparently, my controls are messed up again. Oh, this is just annoying. Controls freaking out. Uh, my pedals aren't working. What the hell? Hold on, folks. Let me see if I can try to fix this. Okay, folks, I'm back. Sorry about that. For some reason, my I went to my controller settings, and the uh, it says the controller inputs are missing. What the fuck was that about? <laughs> oh. Okay, why? What the fuck is going on? <sighs> okay, seriously, this is... Okay. See, look at this, folks. See, the this entire thing was missing. What, what the hell? I don't know why this thing keeps moving. Oh, my cruise control is still still. At least that's working. All right. <laughs> I don't know what the hell caused that. Okay, there we go. I had to turn a, I had to turn a lamp off. <laughs> All right, finally back on the road. Yeah, I'm sorry. Uh, sorry about that, folks. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. For some reason, my controller settings were freaking out. I don't know. I don't know if that's a if that's a bug or something, or that is just freaking weird. Okay. 
Yeah, I'll get back on track, so. Well, um, okay, yeah, well, I had me something to eat, so, uh, you know, from the last part, so. Um, I actually ordered me, uh, some wings from, uh, Hooters, from, uh, Uber Eats. I mean, anybody's ever tried Uber Eats before, but, yeah, that's, that's a dick to you. <laughs> well, because the thing is, I mean, I don't necessarily like to get out on weekends. I'm, I'm one of those people that... Okay, I said cruise control. What the hell? Is now my cruise control not working or something? Or... God. It's one thing, that's the other. Yeah, I'm trying to do a playthrough here. I'm like... I appreciate it. Actually, actually started working. You're supposed to. Necessarily helping. <laughs> Great, I mean, not in this truck the entire way. That's just. <laughs> There's a way station all the way the hell out here? Love those type of people that like just really just go barely go to the speed limit. It's like getting everybody's way and they're just kind of dull and alone. They don't have like a care in the world. Like, well, you know, hey, there's people we got stuck to do. So, <laughs> yeah, this is a casual game. I mean, <laughs> it just got. That's what I get for talking. <laughs> oh man, I seriously folks can not see. <laughs> My cruise does work, so I don't know what was going on with my controller there. Hopefully, that's not a sign of things to come because apparently my controller doesn't want to work. <laughs> yeah, these uh, Xbox One controllers they're not cheap, <laughs> so I think they're about 70 bucks a piece or something. I really don't know. Shift transmission. Come on. Come on. No?
to see bright plots here. All right. Clifton is one of the cities we've not discovered yet, so. We're just driving through. Especially people in trucks or people driving sports cars like Corvettes. This 25 mile an hour thing is just, it just kills people. <laughs> I was like, you know, these things are really not built for speed, but <laughs> still it's the same. It's like, uh, yeah, I kind of want to get through here. I mean, nothing personal. I mean, it is a casual game. There really is no rush, but still, I mean, I don't want my videos to be three or four hours long. It's just well, it's all I'm saying. <laughs> Tell me what I'm doing is I'm kind of speeding up past the speed limit and I'm kind of slowing down. It's a technique I use in my job because a certain train that I have uh, doesn't have cruise control on it. So um, it's one of our newer uh, train models. It's from a company called CAF. It's based out of Spain. Um, and these trains, um, see that a lot of them are locked with lace technology. They have touch screen monitors and stuff like that. But the uh, thing with them is, is that they, they're not... They cannot be uh, attached or what we call coupled, or you know, I mean to uh, you know attach itself to another train um, with our older models because they're Simon's trains. So Simon's and Cap don't mix. So just saying. <laughs> so you know, so the you know the biggest problem with the Cap trains though is that the Cap trains are actually heavier than the Simon's trains. Because um, I think the cat trains are around 93, 94,000 pounds. Uh, so, yeah, they're, they're almost 100,000 pounds, folks. <laughs> so. Yeah. They're, 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 you know, they're nothing, they're nothing to mess around with. You don't necessarily want to be run over by one of those things. It's pretty much instant kill or amputation. So. <laughs> And sadly, folks, I've seen some nasty photos, you know. I've, I've seen some things a lot of the public does not see as far as public transit's concerned, so, you know. So I know people view public transit as nasty, inefficient, not on time, you know. We 
Which is true. <laughs> yeah, the the lot rail system here in you know uh, here in Houston, not the greatest. I was like, I'm not going to completely downgrade them whatsoever. I mean, you know, they surely exist in the Texas Medical Center. It's one of the largest medical centers in the entire United States. You know, people come from all around the world to seek treatment here in Houston. So it, it's no joke. It's like a little, it's like a little city within Houston. It's nothing but hospitals, especially clinics. That's all it is. It's actually, it's quite a sight to see. Um, man, it's 35 miles in there. Man, this blows. It's taking us forever to get through here. <laughs> so. Uh, what the hell that thing is that? Where the hell are we? What is that? Some sort of slow. Two minutes and not because this looks this looks really cool though. This kind of a kind of a tunnel system or something. Uh, I don't know what it is. I tell you what, my transmission's gonna work out. <laughs> it's shifting from air a while all the way from ten to twelve, so. This is why an 18 speed is a must have when you play this game. I was either like to play either a 13, 15, or an 18 speed. I just, I like those the best, you know. The, um, the 15 speeds are not as common in real life. Um, I watched some stuff on YouTube about mainly the 13 and 18 speeds are mainly the most popular ones. Uh, there are some 10 speeds, but those are like smaller box trucks that they use for, you know, lighter loads. So, um, twenty-seven. Oh, wow! These tunnels here are freaking awesome. I had no idea these were even existed. Wow! Get a load of that. It's like a more of like an earthy, rocky terrain, like you can see. Like the just gigantic machines they use to carve out these tunnels. Because they don't use dynamite, because it's kind of unstable. So, <laughs> especially, you know, especially in this part of, you know, this area that that rock is. I mean, it's wild. Well, this drop is pretty awesome, even though it's, it's uh, in the middle of the night, but I mean, we might have to come through here at, uh, during the day and see what this is like. This is really cool. <laughs> so. So once again, folks, um, I want to uh, reiterate that uh, the Oregon DLC is coming out on October 4th. So. I made a note in the comments script the video description of last video about it so yeah so I've got 264 miles to go and I really want to get away from this freaking 35 mile now crap <laughs> miles an hour <laughs> Okay, Raz, stop complaining. Alright. Oh, now we're gonna be going down.
out in hell now. Can't really see much anything, so it's just the dead of night. It's 2:18 in the morning. You know, this is a really cool area, but the speed limit's too low. <laughs> that's my only complaint. <laughs> I'm sure it's that's that low for a reason, but still, just matter of observation, I guess, is the best way to put it. <laughs> so this is why I absolutely love 18 speeds because they are because they're meant for this uh, meant for this type of terrain. 13 speeds would be what they would do okay here, but it's like you can you know challenge yourself if you want to do a 13 speed. But oh no, I just love my 18 speeds. Of course, I don't mind 15 speeds either. 15 speeds are actually quite nice. Okay, we're back to 40 again. <laughs> Slowly but surely we are. Wait, this speed limit will increase about 40 miles an hour. That's all the Oh, come on. Oh, for the love of people. <laughs> <laughs> Screw it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's like, I'm sure this is a beautiful drive during the day, but at night it's like, uh, yeah, what's the point? I'm like, yeah, rest area, no kidding if we're going this in, going in slow. Definitely need a break. I'm not going to take any chances, so I'm not going to be speeding through here, you know. So. so, yeah, what happened to the Rebel Raz? Well, yeah. Yeah, I'm afraid those days have passed, folks. <laughs> I don't necessarily want to do that anymore. 
It was fun while it lasted, but hey, I think it's just my matter of impatience. Eh? It was funny because I was looking at my uh, my startup screen for Steam for this game, and it says that I've logged in over 109 hours. But this is not. This is also including my other profiles I have on here as well. So it's not 109 hours total of this particular um, this particular uh, profile. It's actually a sum of all the profiles. So just in case you're wondering. See, there's a car behind me. That's really kind of getting a little pissed here. You know what I absolutely love? I cannot wait until they get to Texas. I really can't. <laughs> I, Texas, is my, Texas is my home state, y'all. So. Oh, 65. Hallelujah. <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> now we're talking. Why am I going to say a rub like that? You okay? I guess they had a flat tire or something. Takes me back to the time when I drove the bus. Yeah, dropping those things at night is quite fun. <laughs> Especially at 4 or 5 in the morning. <laughs> oh man, those were long days. <laughs> back when I had Tuesday and Wednesdays off. <laughs> man. They weren't so bad, but, you know, at the same time, it's like. I was like, I didn't want to work weekends, but of course, when you first start off with the company, you're gonna you're you know, you're pretty much expected to do that. So yeah. So yeah. <laughs> So I hope everybody's excited for the Oregon DLC. I mean, I I think it's like they see like 14 or 15 new cities or something like that. Uh, I got looking to check the patch and the, uh, the uh, details for it, but I think it's I think it's 14 cities. You know, you have to admire SCS for 
know, and so many cities to a practically small state, you know. Because Oregon is nowhere not even close as, as big as uh, California is. So, California and uh, Nevada were the first two states for this game to be released. I think it's back in, what, 20... I guess like 2015 or 2016? I forgot. <laughs> It's been it's 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 been a few years. <laughs> I had to get the fact that I just do not remember. Um, don't remember that. So so yeah, we must be in New Mexico now. So we're about ninety five miles away from our. Uh, Target here, so look at that. Look at the sunrise, folks. Let's watch the sunrise. Tell you what, they've done a bang up job with this the sunrise and sunset and the, and the sky models and stuff. It's, that's just incredible. You know, it's that really sets a tone, you know, like back in the day it was pretty much a plastic blue or you know, black sky. It's pretty much what it was, you know. Maybe a little bit of cheap reds and oranges and yellows in there, but that's it. But this is really detailed though. I mean, I have to hand it to them, it's it's quite impressive. And I probably need to go ahead and get my truck serviced again. It's probably about time to. I don't know how many miles we put on this thing. <laughs> I'm probably going to put over a million miles on it before I decide to get another one. <laughs> That's the one thing I do wish that they, they have in this game is used trucks. I mean,. I think some people have talked about that. I mean, you know, in their previous games, they were just mainly just cut and paste of one another. Uh, they had, um, you could buy used trucks. That was the first things you bought, you know? They had a lot of miles on them, but considering that they're trucks, you know, they're meant to go a million plus miles before you get rid of them, so. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> that's the wrong, uh, that's the wrong uh, turn lane, that's not going to last to that, so, 
Yeah, you go ahead and you go. All right. <laughs> we're blocked. We're partially blocking the lane. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's my old tricks again. I know. Misinterpreting GPS with rats. <laughs> right. Okay, here we go. All right, this is the right one. Like my <laughs> oh yeah, go figure, right? <laughs> okay, so am I not gonna get a turn signal? What the hell? Cool track. It's not really light outside, is it? If my lighting's messed up. Yeah, I've, I've done one of these intersections before, now, now, that, now that I see it. It's one of those things where just kind of... Yeah, there's a, there's a exit off right there, and this thing just continues on. Why do you do that? I'm like, well, that's why I call a Houston move. <laughs> it's one of my personal favorites. <laughs> this is one of those kind of the traffic without looking. It's, it's a common thing that happens in Houston. <laughs> Let's get it. Want to give you a little bit of taste of Houston love? That's all. <laughs> no, seriously, don't. Yeah, I don't necessarily do that in real life. I mean, that's that's dangerous. I'm, I'm just kidding. But it does happen a lot in Houston, though. I, 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 that's not a lie. That's no joke at all. Okay, folks, we have... You have a right to our destination. You've arrived at your final destination. I really wish that the GPS actually talked. I wonder if anyone's ever suggested that. <laughs> Siri? <laughs> oh, that'd be so cool if you had one of those. <laughs> had a Siri, a Siri implemented into your truck. I'm sure someone's going to make a mod for that one of these days. 
it's this way. <laughs> Is that just a fence? Oh no, it could be either or. Whoa, hello there, dude. I guess he's um, uh, some lumber or something he's hauling. It's not lumber. It's a kind of lumber you can sell for land for cattle. Anybody does anybody know the reference? To that? I don't know if you uh, the Adventures of the Bible. I don't know if anyone's ever. <laughs> it was an old children's show back from the '80s. <laughs> Yeah, it was, uh, um, Adventures, Adventures in the Bible or something like that. There's this girl and this, uh, this Indian guy. So, it's, it's right here, right? Oh! Raz, you were a doofus. It was right there. I'm such a motherfucking doofus. Is there, is there anything behind this? Oh, there's something. What did I say about you, Terrence? <laughs> okay! Right? So, uh, I stand corrected. <laughs> U-turns are bad for trucks, but I'm not going to be driving all the way the hell over there. I'm just not doing that shit. No. Strickland says no. <laughs> yeah. uh, the hell have we got here? Is this gate open? Oh, that is badass. We're going in the plane? <laughs> oh, no, it's right next to it, but... Oh, that is awesome. <laughs> oh. Okay, Raz, you're being way too distracted here. Same person, Raz. Oh, oh, we're so good at this. We're doing this. We're going, to, uh, going through it this way. Probably a very expensive plane. We don't. <laughs> I think you know if you want that, you can just get this one. So we work out the way that I wanted it, but it's fine. Not, not my best performance there, but I guess, I guess that'll work. Sky delivery. That is awesome. I want to see more of those. Okay, so I want to do more high value cargoes. Okay then. Uh, now that's something that's gonna do with the. Um, all right, so that that uh, that's 
Done. Okay. So, Santa Fe. Question of the day. Sound there. Come on. Oh, those are completely the opposite directions. Come on! There's Ratton. That's going that way. You know what? Let's drive to Santa Fe and see if we can try to, um... I'm just gonna drive to... I'm just gonna physically drive to Santa Fe. Fuck. <laughs> Oh, this is badass, though. Let me see. Dude. <laughs> oh, man. Too bad you could not park that in the plane. That'd be fucking awesome. I have to say, oh, that is... God, I had to kind of take, take it back for a minute. But anyway, folks... That's what we're gonna. That's where we're gonna stop here for now. Um, I'm gonna take a little bit of a rest break, and then when we come back, uh, we're gonna take a little drive to Santa Fe to go ahead and discover that city and see if we can try to find something that will, that will uh, discover the last city, and then head back to San Diego. So hopefully, I'll, hopefully I should be able to finish this. Not if today, maybe tomorrow. So, all right, thank, all right, guys. Thanks for watching.